Welcome to the VES Artex Academy. Let's go learn about fans. Today we will learn how to configure your ProTech variable frequency drive to the proper settings after it has been installed. Since you have already installed the VFD on your fan, you will not need any special tools or equipment for this procedure. The only thing you will need is the quick start guide, which contains all configurations you will have to perform. On the front of the VFD, there is a keypad underneath the display screen. There are up, down, enter, and back buttons for navigating through the interface. The start and stop buttons will allow you to start or stop the motor. The control button will activate keypad control and the direction button will change the rotating direction of your fan. Before you begin entering parameters, it is a good idea to test the fan to ensure there are no issues with the installation. To do so, press Control, Enter, and then press Start. At this point, your fan should begin running. You can use the up and down arrows to manipulate the speed of your fan. Now that you have performed a test and you know that your fan is running properly, it is time to configure the parameters of your VFD. Press Enter to go to the menu. There are eight groups that you can navigate to using the up and down arrows. We want to begin configuring our parameters in group zero. Press Enter. Our first parameter in group zero is P220.00, acceleration time one. Press Enter to select this parameter. As you can see, the default is set to five seconds. Press the up arrow until the screen reads 60.0 seconds. It is important that you press and hold enter for at least 3 seconds until the screen reads p.saved. This means that the parameter will be saved permanently. If you only press enter briefly, then the parameter will only be saved for one cycle. Let's continue to the next parameter, which is P221.00. It looks like this VFD is already configured to 60 seconds. So I'll press and hold the enter button for at least three seconds until the screen reads P.saved. The next parameter is at P302.00. The default will be set to 0 linear, but we want to change it to 1 quadratic. Press and hold enter for at least 3 seconds until the screen reads p.save. Continue to enter all the parameters on the quick start guide for group 0 and group 2. The group 1 parameters will display diagnostic information that will come in handy if you ever encounter an error with your fan or VFD. 